you before and after effect on using the M-series drive. So BC Mark, BC Mark score, which I'm sure you all know, it's a general score for the system, overall uh, point score system for performance. Uh, it is going from 4,300 points to 6,300 points. Not a staggering increase until you look at the hard drive score itself. So the hard drive score is a subset of the PC Mark score and it's strictly tense testing. As you know, simulated operating system loading, simulated application loading, and simulated file copy loading. It is going from 4,600 to 20, almost 28,000 points. And that is roughly, if you do the math, 492% increase in performance. So quite a great, uh, great performance increase on the, on the benchmark. This is uh, just a quick overview. We are giving our, our products for testing to worldwide to many uh, benchmark uh, websites, uh, also IT magazines, and all of them are, uh, you know, giving us really good reviews just for our entry level series V series, uh, and for the others V plus. You will see what is our full range. Uh, what we have in, in our range of products. Uh, as I said, for our entry-level drive V-series, which we are promoting heavily right now, uh, they're giving us really good reviews. Uh, you can see just a couple of them. You can see online to, to search for it. Uh, it's, uh, it's getting better for, for every, uh, for this uh, series that are like V <coughs> or M. So you can see uh, we have, basically we have four uh, different series of SSDs. It's E, F, V plus, and V series. Uh, pretty soon, uh, what is the launch date for me? Before the I think it's November 9th. November 9th. Uh, yeah. In a couple of days from now, we will launch the V40. It's uh, some kind of uh, sub series under the V series. Uh, I will tell you a little bit more about it. So, this first one, SSD E, we are doing that together with Intel. It is the fastest drive on the, on the market. There is no faster SSD on the market right now. It's uh, designed for server environment, mainly. I mean, you can use it in your uh, own systems uh, at home, but it's uh, a little bit too expensive for that. Uh, it is the, 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 the fastest drive on the market, but on the other hand, it is the most expensive drive on the market right now. So it has 250 uh, megabytes, per, uh, megabytes per second of read speed and uh, 170 megabytes per second of write speed. Uh, the good, uh, uh, if you look at the specification uh, for this particular drive, because it's meant for, uh, for server environment, the number of EOS, uh, uh, which means it stands for uh, input output per second, the number of data that can be transferred uh, in and out of this drive is uh, 35,000. So uh, that's the that shows that it's the fastest drive on the market. You can see all the others are decreasing when it comes to the, uh, if we are moving to, to V series, it decreased dramatically. And uh, also uh, very important, uh, very important uh, data in the specification of these drives is uh, two million uh, hours of mean time before failure. Uh, which means that this drive could last 100 years. It will, uh, it, it will last longer than uh, all the, the systems that uh, it is uh, it's implemented in. So uh, after E series, which is for server environment, there is an M series, which is typically uh, typically for enterprise, but it's also used by uh, prosumers, uh, enthusiasts like yourself who wants to, to test the the, the uh, hardware, the, the newest hardware on the on the market, and the, the, the fastest one also. So uh, this is a little bit slower drive than E series. It has the same uh, reading speed of 200 megabytes per second, but the writing speed is uh, lower than E series. It's uh, 70 megabytes per second, and also uh, the number of EOPS uh, are, are reducing. But in this particular, it, it, it is designed to be a replacement uh, of AGD in uh, corporate notebooks uh, of these guys who are traveling a lot, uh, who are you know doing business on the field. So uh, it also decreased this number of EOPS. It is not that important data for, for this usage. And uh, 1.2 million uh, hours mean time before failure is also a very, very high rate, probably it will, uh, it will last for 50 years, uh, so it's uh, still huge number. Then we have B plus series, which is the, uh, we are placing that in the middle of our offer. It is a very 
good, uh, it has very good uh, performance uh, when, when it comes to the price per performance. Uh, it, this drive, I mean, 64 gig of uh, V plus costs around 160, 170 euros street price. So it is not that big amount anymore. We are not talking about hundreds of, of euros, we are talking about 170 euros for a drive that will dramatically uh, change your, the performance of your system. So it has 220 megabytes uh, of read speed, 140 of write speed. This is the, the lowest, uh, lowest possible number. The higher the density is, the higher the capacity is, the drive becomes uh, faster. So uh, we, have, we are talking about 128 gigs. Uh, the uh, uh, writing speed is 170, and the future one, which we have all only in US uh, till now, uh, 256 gigs of this series, uh, the writing speed is 180. So when the, 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 the capacity is increasing, the speed is increasing, quite opposite of uh, HD drives. So uh, at our entry level, what we are, uh, this is designed for uh, consumer segment, for PC assemblers, for notebook assemblers, for guys who, for guys who just want to replace their HDD in their, uh, uh, in their laptops. We have V series, which is really, uh, I think, it's the, 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 the cheapest drive on the market when it comes to the uh, price per performance. Uh, you can you can get this one below 100 euros street price. So uh, 64 gig of, of, of these drives could be found, I think, below 100 euros. So uh, the specification is 180. I mean, 100 of uh, read speed, uh, uh, megabytes per second of read speed, uh, speed and uh, 80 megabytes per second of uh, write speed. Uh, the mean time, uh, one million hours mean time for failure is the same like uh, with uh, with plus. And the drive that which we are going to promote uh, heavily, and the drive uh, which is going to uh, appear pretty soon, in uh, just a couple of days from now, it's uh, V40. Uh, you can see that this drive, uh, we are producing that right now in a capacity of only 40 gig. It is meant to be a, as a bootable drive in a desktop. So it is not, it, we don't think that it will replace the HDD drive in, in your systems, but it will be, you can just add it as a bootable drive and uh, to continue to have your uh, regular HDD when you will store the data that uh, data that doesn't need some, some uh, fast drive like, like SSD. So the read speed is 170, the write speed is 40. Uh, but check out this, uh, this number, number of EOPS uh, is 31,000, almost 32,000. So it corresponds to E-series, the fastest series on, on the market. So uh, in this laptop there is a V40, so uh, you will see how it works, you will see the, how, it, how it works comparing to the regular HDD, HDD drive. So uh, we will talk about it uh, a little bit later about uh, V40 also in the, in the details. And uh, with this V series, the, the consumer uh, series, the, uh, uh, for, for retail stores, we are uh, offering bundles, desktop and notebook bundle. Within the desktop bundle, we are offering, uh, a, 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 of course, we are offering the, the drive itself, uh, some uh, brackets, fixing brackets for 3.8 inch uh, bracket in, in, in the system, uh, CD with a chronic software for cloning. Uh, you can do easily, uh, you can easily clone your uh, existing